So on this dry sump system, there's a block with uh, two inputs, two outputs. That's uh, a quarter inch fitting on the top of the block. Uh, one output is to the motor and one outputs to the turbo. You can see here is the 90 degree output fitting that I had to get. I had to put a couple springs in with my power steering pump to up the pressure, which worked out fine. Uh, here's the oil supply, the pa uh, pressure on a GT35 turbo with an exhaust ball bearing. Uh, this 90 degree fitting helps it, you know, it keeps the, the hood from hitting, so there's no issues there. Uh, dash 10 on the oil line coming out from the actual uh, oil pan or the sump pan. From the sump, uh, the stock oil uh, sump takes over and pulls the oil out and throws it into the external tank that I made. And on the far wall, uh, this is my input to the pump. Right side is return, left side is feed. And here the feed is on the right side. I needed this system because as you can see in the frames before, the clearance was way too low, which only gave me about three, four quarts of oil. As we're now, it's up to a gallon and a half. So the oil stays really cool. Dash 10 fittings on the right, dash six on the left. And let's hear this thing fire up. And it sustains oil pressure quite well. guys at Itis Clothing and Design, we can do this for you. Thanks.